see it. All right, this is Cliff Cave Park. They have a pavilion right here. We are doing this river trail. Um, the caves are over there. Okay. The one cave is over there. That's not the trail we're doing right now. These houses are bit on, built on the cliff and the river is over here. Is this the Missouri River? Nope. No, I always get it wrong. What river is it, honey? I think it's the Mississippi. Oh, look, it's Batman. <laughs> it is Batman. <laughs> I love it. Anyway, I got distracted by Batman. There's several trails throughout this park. There is a cave that you can hike to, um, but that's not the trail for the 30 for 30. I think this is the trailhead right here. I can hear a train. There's also, that could be the trailhead too. Barge, that's a barge? Barge have horns like trains? Mm -hmm. Interesting. All right, I, Mississippi River Trail, I see the little red punch. This is new too, this field, that's, I think that's private park. That's private property, you go, the trail is to the right. I think that's, the farmer owns that. There's the red punch. It's number 21 on the punch. A little spider web action going on. Don't Who's get bit this? by a spider. Oh, there it is. Was that? Yeah, I think it's 21. Yeah, no, that's fine. Double. That's fine. Horseshoe. 20 is Buddha. We haven't done that one yet. So, 21. Alright, so this trail is actually, if you do the entire trail, like a five mile loop. Uh, but if you fo follow the trail, for the 30 for 30 hike, it's only like a two mile, one mile down, one mile back. So that's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna do the two miles. Because I'm hungry. And that's our favorite pizza place is nearby. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna hike for two miles and then go have pizza and salad at Janino's. Right, or is it Janino's? Janino's. And if this was Florida, there would be alligators in there. But it's not. It's Missouri. With, there's like a one in one million chance of running across the black bear. That's about it. All right, so we're gonna be turning left. It's a good thing we don't wanna do the five mile trail because it looks like it's flooded. But Robert used to live near here and we would, we would walk this a lot, but that's not part of the 30 for 30, thank goodness. Mississippi was up. All right, you can kind of see houses. So the houses are like that. Robert says one of the houses was owned by Kenny Wallace. Or his brother. Or his brother. Oh, one of the Wallace racer guys. I don't either. I don't know, particularly pay attention to racing or much celebrity stuff in general. All I know is those houses are million dollar houses. Oh yeah, they, they started a million. I mean, they, they There's another, you can kind of see that one. Kind of. Whenever I see houses like that, I just think of mudslides. Yeah. So, this is just. They're on, a, they're on the rock though, so. Yeah, like story time. So when I worked at Yellowstone a hundred billion years ago, one of my coworkers was an older lady. And she was talking about when she used to live in California. She was married to a rich guy. They had tons of nice stuff. And they lived on a cliff in California. And they lost everything in a month's life. And they had to start all over because insurance didn't cover everything. And I was like, oh, it was just like a sad story. Because she's like, they lost. Just listing all this expensive stuff they lost. And I was like, wow. And all I could think was, should have had better insurance. But what do I know? I always make sure we're properly insured. You don't really have unless you build a subdivision on a hill. Yeah. But here, it's all rock. Like, they built on rock. Yeah. The house isn't going so, that house is not going anywhere? No. That beautiful house right there? An earthquake for sure. It's pretty. 
It's pretty. So anyway, that was just this. Peggy was her name. I really liked her. She was super nice. But she had some stories. Anyway, so then ever since that story, I, I just think about my slides. Which is not really an issue in here in Missouri. We used to actually bike this trail too. I forgot that I did actually used to ride a bike. I prefer walking now. But um, you used to be able to see the river. But it's all grown up now. And like, I'm, you know, we used to bushwhack. I'm past that. I'm no longer a bushwhack babe. I'm like, nope, no ticks for me. Nope, I'll stay on that des designated path where I don't have to worry about a tick infestation. Is that the sign up there? No. Mm -hmm. I think the sign is grown overgrown. You know what I'm saying? But I do like these like, these like dead trees intermingled. Here's a path. Let's, yeah. let's see if we can see the river. As, as long as it's not too bushwhacky because I don't feel like ticks today. It's very sandy. That's kind of weird. That's, that's, that is right here. All right. Please no ticks. Please no ticks. Public fishing. I'm gonna get ticks, I know it. There are, there are of course there's snakes. Snake. I don't, do you see a snake? There is no cobras. Water snake. Right here, don't touch these plants. <laughs> now I feel like something weird is gonna happen. We have left the designated trail. You what? That's a huge barge. Oh, it is a huge barge. I really wanted to see the river, so. Let's just, let's just hope that there's actually a view up here and it wasn't for nothing. Oh, ticks also fall from trees. Gotta be careful. They're attracted by your scent, your body scent. What's the, they wait the, till you're nearby and they fall on you. So the boat that leaves from New Orleans? Yeah. They docked here at Cliff Cave to let people off at some point. Oh, they did? Yeah, because they couldn't use some other location. Oh my gosh, look at this! So cool! This is neat. It's not, don't fall in. Whirlpools. There's a barge! Is he even moving? No, he's not moving. Yeah, he's not moving. He's hanging out. Is he in front? Yeah. No, set to it that's is in the way. Alright. Don't trip and fall. Do not trip and fall. Do not trip and fall. Okay. So what he's talking about is all along. Lots of logs. You can take a picture and zoom in so we can see what it looks like. 